Ito na nga guys, so balikan natin ang mga naging representative ng Pilipinas para sa Mr. World Pageant. Right, so this video is para doon sa aking community post kung saan nagkaroon ng 56% na sabi nila ay mag-vlog ako about male beauty pageant. Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. This is Roderick Cruz Abala. Kung bago ka lang sa akin channel at gusto mo ang mga video about beauty pageants, please subscribe to my channel and huwag kakalimutan ang notification bell para hindi kayo mahuli sa mga susunod ko i-upload. Alright? Wala na patumpik-tumpik guys. Balikan natin or magbalik tanaw tayo sa mga naging representative ng Pilipinas para sa Mr. World Pageant. Para lang sa mga hindi nakakaalam, dati ang Mr. World Philippines ay ginaganap or organized ng Binibining Pilipinas Charities Incorporated or BPCI. And until 2010, I believe, ito ay nakuha ni Cory Quirino. And then after that, after a few years, ito nga ay napunta na kay Arnold Vega Fria o AVL. So, wala nang patumpik-tumpik. Sige, balikan natin sino ba yung kauna-unahang naging representative ng Pilipinas para sa Mr. World Philippines or Mr. World Beauty Badge. Manilenio Christopher Celis was then 20 years old, senior fine arts student of UST when he won the inaugural Mr. World Philippines in 1996 to compete in the inaugural Mr. World pageant held in Istanbul, Turkey with 50 candidates but unfortunately he didn't make it to the semi-finals. He loves to paint and he has a good exposure to folk dancing. The next one is Batangueño Rico Lee Miguel. He was 24 years old and he is a graduate of marine technology from Philippines Maritime Institute in Manila. He unfortunately did not make the spot in semi-finals. Six-footer, full-blooded Igorot Roderick Salvador was 22 years old, AB English graduate from University of Baguio, model and a regional TV news anchor. A physical therapist, Dabawenyo Marco Tamayo from Davao Doctors Hospital competed in the fourth edition of Mr. World Pageant in London, England. Bicolano Emmanuel Mago with a towering height of 6'3 was a management student at the Emilio Aguinaldo College when he won the title of Mr. World Philippines in 2007. He was a member of EAC's senior basketball team and a coach of the school's junior team. He was unfortunately did not place. The last one representative under BPCI is 6'1 tall from Isabella Albin de Hoya a model and a registered nurse who graduated from Far Eastern University in Manila and competed in the 2010 edition of Mr. World with 74 candidates but did not place unfortunately. And around 2012, the right or the franchise of Mr. World Philippines. Their first winner is none other than 6'1 tall rugby player Andrew Wolf. Andrew Wolf is a rugby player half Filipino half British. The next one is 6'1 tall 2012 Century Tuna Super Bud winner, Jan Spainauer, half American, half Filipino. He is a model, actor, and a former U.S. Army competed in Mr. World 2014, but unfortunately did not make it to semifinals. Same fate as for Sam Ajdani. 5'11 tall, half Iranian, half Filipino, he competed in Mr. World 2016 but also failed to earn the spot in semi-finals. He is a model and a 2020 Century Tuna Super Bad winner. And then another person earned right of Mr. World Philippines or Mr. World Philippines franchise. And he is none other than Arnold 
Vega Fria. So Arnold Vega Fria is the current owner or franchise owner of Miss World Philippines. The first winner of Mr. World Philippines under Arnold Vega Frias management is a 25 years old a sports and science degree holder is a member of UP's baseball team. He is an actor and a model. During Mr. World 2019, he was awarded Mr. Asia Pacific and was one of the top 12 finalists. At hanggang dito na lang guys, yan ang mga nagugwapuhang representative ng Pilipinas sa mga nakaraan o nakalipas na Mr. World Pageant. Ano ang masasabi nyo sa aking video? Please and again, kung hindi pa kayo nakasubscribe, subscribe na kayo. And huwag kalimutan ng notification bell para hindi kayo makuli sa aking mga susunod na upload. Alright? So thank you for watching, stay safe, be safe, and stay healthy. Right? Thank you very much and bye-bye!